Stacy here. Today I just received this from my mail, and we are going to unboxing Google Glass version two in this video. The look of this box actually is pretty much the same as the version one. You can see here has the logo of the Google X team, and on the front is the glass text. My color is Tangerine Explore Edition. So let's open it. This is my glass. Waxy paper as a cover. It's the same package as last time. There is uh, instructions show you how to get started with the glass. That's very cool. That is my first time noticing it. So let's peel it off, right? You can kind of like sneak peek what it is. Dun 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 Well, I have been wanting this color for the longest time. The first time I placed my order, they didn't have Tangerine the color. So I picked the white. And this time I was patient enough. I waited and yep. So I made sure I got the color I wanted. So the box has all the instructions of how this device is going to work. And here's the top part. Let's remove it, see what's inside. And of course, it comes with another pouch. I have one, and this is my second one. It's a little instruction of telling you how to use the magical pouch. And uh, this is, oh, so it's a new earphone. I was not expecting it. Actually, I'm really glad they had this because I actually had difficult time to hear my phone call while I was using my glass to make phone call. And uh, here it is. Of course, you have all the guidelines of how to use it. It's the back side. It's a um, micro USB. It's a little book. I don't know. Oh, this must be the nose pad because you actually can change the nose pad based on your nose size. I have the Asian nose, so I need to use the smallest. Let's see. And here it is. It's the same thing we received uh, the first time. So we actually can change the nose pad size. So it just to make you feel more comfortable and they're like transparent it says total comfort right on the nose and of course we still have the charger in the cable as last time it's the same look I don't know if you guys know this the cable actually is supposed to be a stand for your glass as well so if you take your glass plug it in and it is actually supposed to stand up. That's how they introduced it. Like a lot of people make their own stand. Maybe it's like, you know, make it more stable. However, the cable itself, it's actually a stand. It's like stand up on a table, on a surface, and it would totally work. Let's see more about the glass itself. For the first look, I really don't see any differences as before, besides the earbud. Here is the uh, usual. This is the uh, same bone conduction. Inside is the screen. Here is the head-on detection. And yeah, I don't see any significantly differences from the look of it. And then put it on. What do you think about the color? I hope it looks great. <laughs> So yeah, let me see if everything works. I hope we have batteries on. A lot of girls actually complain about the hair problem and I guess we just have to change our hairstyle to make the glass look better. I don't know. Let's talk a bit more about the accessories. Accessories are the major changes in the version 2. First, we do receive a shade with the glass. It is the same as uh, the first version. 
which is the regular sunglasses lens. It comes in a little pouch. You can just take it out. It's like this. I really enjoy clipping on lenses on my Google Glass. It just really pleasant. Well, let me show you. So here's a frame. Just put it in and slowly twist it. It is on. The shape is more like a cool looking lenses. It's more look like matrix. Kind of match my hairstyle, but you know, personally, I don't own any black sunglasses. And this another lens you can purchase separately, which is a clear one. I think the major use of this is more like for eye protection, also reduce the social awkwardness, because when you're wearing a frame, it has no lenses. Some people may feel it's come kind of different. Let's try the clear one. Let's remove it the same way. Replace it with the clear lens. It is more like a personal preferences. When I'm buying sunglasses, I usually choose a kind of transparency look. Actually, the new accessory, which everyone was looking for, was the earbud. I'm really excited for it, and uh, let's put it on. This is my first time using it. Actually, I hope I'm using it correctly. Put it in the ear. Actually, you can hide it under your hair, so nobody knows you're wearing an earbud. Well, here is my unboxing. I hope you guys liked the video, and please subscribe. Bye.